What's up, MG? This is Vince bringing you another Marvel vs. Capcom 3 game. This guy's about to rank up. Uh, actually, I don't know if he wins, he's about to rank up. But anyways, I am on the left for once. He's on the right using Ryu, Deadpool, and Sentinel. Um, once again, I'm assuming Sentinel is going to be an assist character, not really doing much on his own. Uh, whether it'll be a physical Sentinel or a projectile spammer Sentinel, I really can't tell. It's one of those things that's 50-50. Deadpools typically are good for about three hits up close and then they just typically uh, spam grenades or shoot their guns and it usually goes in sequence. Uh, Ryu is the kind of play uh, wild card in this setup. He can either, he, usually Ryus are fairly in your grill but if you want to run away they're just gonna spam projectiles as well. So I'm thinking once again this is a good straight across matchup. X-23 can go through uh, Deadpool's guns. Wesker's gun actually goes over Ryu's Hadouken which is good for me. And, Sent and Sentinel uh, can easily get taken down by Akuma. It basically, for that matchup, goes to whoever gets the first hit off. So, let's get on with it. Um, I actually have not watched this game. For some reason, the sound is off for once, so I can't actually hear what's going on. But let us see what's going... Uh, let's see what, how this is going to turn out. So knowing myself, I'm probably going to start off... Oh, okay, so I was going to start off with a uh, counter grab. And because he didn't uh, try to grab me, that doesn't work. He's going to go straight for the Super Hadouken, which tells me that he's a projectile-based uh, Ryu. And he is going to start calling in the Sentinel Assist, which means that I get to punish Sentinel Assist. Yay! My favorite thing to do in this whole game. Punish Sentinel Assist. Wesker is very good at it. And as you can see, he is... He's hes really trying to uh, not really get too much in my face. But you'll notice those three low kicks and then... Uh, going into a hurricane kick. That's basically a staple. Because I do switch between Dormammu and Akuma, I'm actually surprised that I did that right because I typically uh, mess that up. Anyways, I'm pretty surprised that he actually predicted the Shoryuken. I guess it's something that I don't do a lot, so I don't expect people to think I will. But it's the obvious move. Uh, I will jump with Akuma's high jump. And it's not a super jump, it's not a uh, regular jump, it's somewhere in the middle. And, and the downside is that uh, I can't block during it, so I will get uh, owned a bit by that. You can see his Deadpool is just spamming the gun, unfortunately. But I do get through. I did punish Sentinel with that last Super Hadouken that I did. Uh, whoever gets angered that I call it a Super Hadouken, I'm sorry, but you're just going to have to deal with that. That's what I call it. And uh, these games, by the way, all the all three videos that I've posted on this channel for Marvel vs. Capcom were from the same day. And it actually, I just recorded like... It was like 15 games in a row or something. I did really well. But uh, since then, my strategy has changed a little bit. My playstyle has changed a little bit. Anyways, he finishes off Akuma. And I believe I said uh, in the loading screen that Akuma was basically my best chance to take out every person on his team. But Akuma did do quite a bit of damage if you look at the health gauge. The Sentinel is recovering, though. Uh, if I were better at snapbacks, I would definitely bring out Sentinel and kill him first. I try to get a lucky uh, hyper off as Wesker. But I always forget that Wesker has almost no invincibility on that. So it's not going to go down. He's going to X-Factor Sentinel. That basically calls a good game for me. And uh, I realize that I can go through this a little too late. So it looks like this at this point in time it should be GG. But he misses because of the X-Factor speed boost. I am not going to miss because I am a beast with X-23. And that will finish off the game. So... <laughs> Once again, a, a, a game that I did not expect myself to win. You know, once Sentinel get, got that hit off level 3 X-Factor uh, on X-23, it should be g game over right there. Almost guaranteed. But uh, stuff happens. Anyways, guys, hope you're still enjoying the series. I enjoy the game still. Peace out.